Artists have been working for nearly two weeks on a new mural in downtown Scranton, a project months in the making by the Lackawanna County Arts and Culture Program. Newswatch 16's Courtney Harrison spoke with the artist behind the design and how his inspiration has local ties. With each brush stroke and spray of paint, the mural at the end of the Biden Expressway is taking shape. Los Angeles mural artist John Park was commissioned to paint the large scale mural, transforming both sides of the concrete retaining wall in Scranton to represent the four seasons of Northeast PA. I basically just thought about like different activities and things that people could do around here that also encompasses those seasons. It's kind of built a narrative around that. Park credits his fiance, Julie Hunter, as his muse. Hunter grew up in Lackawanna County and graduated from Abington Heights in 2005. Hunter says she's always admired other murals in Lackawanna County. I'm always trying to find more reasons to come back home and we love painting all over. So it was a very, you know, symbiotic <laughs> connection. Currently, they are working on the wall that represents summer and fall activities. A girl swimming, a fisherman and a train are already visible. The rest of the wall, there's going to be like a football player and then kids running through a pumpkin patch and then uh, fall leaves. And then on the other side is going to be skiers, um, some local uh, flora and fauna possibly. Lake swimming, number one. I loved going up to the fall pack when I was young and swimming in the water. Uh, I never got too into fishing, but know plenty of fishermen. And yeah, there's a lot of fun activities. So far, the response from the community has been positive. So we're getting nice uh, coffee and snack drop off, some honks and waves. We're just really embracing the local community again and having fun with all the you know positive shout outs we get. Park and Hunter will take a break over the winter and plan to resume painting on the other wall in May. Courtney Harrison, Newswatch 16, Scranton.